Hello out there everyone and welcome to another vlog from the water. Um, today actually the uh, the mayflies has been hatching quite a lot the past couple of days and I fished uh, for I got a, a pretty nice fish on Monday but um, the weather just screamed like sea trout instead of uh, instead of fishing the uh, the Danica hatch so I decided to take the first trip of the year fishing with the foam beetle. Conditions look pretty good uh, especially in particular for sea trout but um, it's very 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 early it's earlier than than I've ne I've never caught a sea trout uh, in in the river on the foam beetle this early yet but I have kind of a feeling there's been a lot of rain uh, during the past week and the the water level has risen quite a bit so I'm pretty sure that there are sea trout here already um, it's just a matter of uh, if I have the skill to uh, to get them to rise to my uh, my beloved uh, uh, foam fly, so I'm gonna give it a go, see how uh, everything turns out. But um, it would just be absolutely amazing if I could if I could uh, if, I, if I could land a sea trout today. Okay, well here goes. There it is, the wonderful and beautiful little stream here. I've uh, fished most of the uh, most of the uh, the water that I have available here. Fished almost all of the the really really best spots, and uh, and I've walked along the river bank uh, along the river all the way up to see if I could at least spook a sea trout. But so far, no luck. I've seen uh, a lot of the small uh, brown trouts and uh, and uh, and and all the all the uh, the sea trout from the from the spawning this winter i've seen many many of those but not an actual sea trout but well that is how it is um, i like to be uh, you know um, i like to explore like this to just go out here and just basically just just see if i can be the first one to spot something to to be the first one that rides the wave um, and a lot of the times that does not pay off, at least in regards to uh, to actually fish landed. But it's always worth it to get out here in the in the river valley, and uh, and on those occasions where where you know a hunch or or you think that there might be something um, underway, when your hunch is uh, is correct, you can often be the first one to 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 be on the fish. And to be the first one, those those days where 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 you where you hit hit a particular uh, um, type of fishing just right, those days are well worth the effort of uh, of of you know occasionally not catching anything. And I thought there would be fish here. I thought I could be if I were lucky. I could I could you know I could uh, get the f the first one that entered the river. Um, but I don't think it's gonna happen today. Uh, but anyway, I know that today I have been the first fisherman on this piece of river this year. And that alone, at least to me, is awesome. <laughs> so I'm gonna fish the rest of uh, the rest of this uh, this this part of the river, and, and then I'm gonna go home. I had a wonderful time. Everything was awesome, but no fish, but you know, that is how it is. I finished fishing the uh, the last of the water here. And as I foresaw, there was not a fish there either. So, <laughs> well, as I said, that was to be expected, but um, it just felt so right to go fishing with the foam beetle today for the sea trout. So basically, I just I could so so why not do it? Um, I knew it was early, um, but it was what was I felt like, so it had to be. Um, but otherwise, you know, the coastal fishing here in Denmark is is really really performing well just now. There is a lot of salmon running as well. There is the mayfly hatches. There's still some garfish, you can always get some of those. So the fishing here in Denmark is just absolutely prime, or at least on the verge of being 
the best it is each year. So really looking forward to this the next couple of months. They're gonna be legendary. Uh, well, anyway, thanks a lot for watching these rants and I know they don't contain a lot of fish. Well, not at least not all of the time, but yeah, we have a lot of videos about fish We're with uh, yeah, with, with a lot of fish in them as well on the channel. So this is basically just you know a short update on on what I'm fooling around with just every now and then. But I mean, yeah. Thank you a lot for watching, and uh, I wish you uh, the best of luck out on the water.